Hello, everyone, and welcome to my channel where I review the latest and greatest movies and shows. Today, I'm going to talk about one of the most anticipated films of the year, Renaissance, a film by Beyonce. This is a uh, documentary concert film that follows the development and execution of the Renaissance World Tour, Beyonce's record-breaking 2023 stadium tour in support of her seventh studio album, Renaissance. The film is written, directed, and produced by Beyonce herself and features appearances by her family, friends, and collaborators. It is currently playing in theaters worldwide, and I had the chance to watch it last night. So without further ado, let's get into the review. First of all, let me just say that this film is a masterpiece. It is not just a concert film, but a celebration of Beyonce's artistry, vision, and legacy. Um, it showcases her incredible talent, creativity, and work ethic as well as her passion, purpose, and personality. It's the creation, the preparation, and the performance. Uh, each part gives us a glimpse into Beyonce's process, challenges, and achievements, as well as the themes and messages of her album and tour. The creation part focuses on the making of the album Renaissance, which was inspired by Beyonce's desire for escapism during the COVID-19 pandemic. Uh, the album is a Joyce and eclectic celebration of post 1970s black dance music and ball culture. And it features collaborations with artists like Diana Ross, Megan, the stallion and Kendrick Lamar. The film shows us how Beyonce conceived, wrote and recorded the songs as well as how she incorporated elements of history, culture, and spirituality into her music. We also get to see how she balanced her artistic endeavors with her personal life as a wife, mother and daughter. The, Preparation part focuses on the planning and rehearsing of the Renaissance World Tour, which was Beyonce's sixth solo headlining concert tour. The tour consisted of 120 shows across six continents, and it broke several commercial and critical records. The film shows us how Beyonce designed, directed, and produced the tour, as well as how she assembled and trained a diverse and talented team of dancers, musicians, and crew members. We also get to see how she dealt with the physical, mental, and emotional demands of the tour, as well as the unexpected challenges and surprises that came along the way. The performance part focuses on the execution and delivery of the Renaissance World Tour, uh, which was a spectacular and immersive experience for the fans and the audience. Uh, the film shows us the highlights of the tour from the opening in Stockholm, Sweden, to the finale in Kansas City, Missouri. We get to witness Beyonce's amazing stage presence, vocal prowess, and dance skills, as well as her interaction and connection with the crowd. We also get to enjoy the stunning visuals, costumes, and choreography of the show, as well as the powerful and uplifting messages of the songs. The film by Beyonce is a must watch for anyone who loves music, art, and culture. It is a testament to Beyonce's brilliance, influence, and impact, as well as a tribute to her fans family, and community. Khan Academy is a film that inspires, entertains, and educates, and it is a film that makes you feel proud, happy, and alive. I give it a 10 out of 10, and I highly recommend it to everyone. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.